Hey there, viewers. Do you have gout? It can be painful. Gout is a type of arthritis that causes pain, irritation, and inflammation. One way to control these painful flare-ups is with your diet. Your diet can have a major effect on your health, and in today's video, we're going to give you some great foods to eat when you have gout. Can I eat red meat? Should I avoid all alcohol? Are cherries the answer? We're going to talk about all of this and more, so keep watching until the end. What is gout? First of all, if you think your health is in jeopardy in any way, you should get checked out by your doctor, especially if you think you have gout. Gout is a painful form of arthritis that affects over 8 million people across the US. It causes different parts of the body, around the joints, to swell up with the onset of pain. The most common places gout will affect in the body are the big toes, but it can happen along the wrist, fingers, knees, and heels. Gout pain is basically caused by too much uric acid in the bloodstream. Uric acid is produced by the body when breaking down certain foods that have high amounts of purine in them. If the body can't get rid of excess purine, it causes crystals to form and build up around the joints, which can be very painful. The pain can last anywhere from 12 hours to 10 days. Gout is usually caused by certain foods like sugary drinks, sweets, refined carbohydrates like pasta and bread, and also foods that are high in purines. Gout is treated by medications that lower uric acid, but you can help out this condition by paying attention to what you eat and changing up your lifestyle just a bit. Let's go get some of the foods you can have if you have gout. But before we get into the good stuff, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you never miss any updates from Bestie. Number 1. Drink lots of water. Yeah, we know this one isn't food, but it's really important for you to stay hydrated, especially if you have a gout flare-up. It's recommended that you drink about 8 glasses or so of water daily. But if you're experiencing a painful attack from gout, you can increase that to 16 glasses. This will help flush the excess uric acid from your system and keeps you hydrated. Number 2. Cherries Fruit in general is pretty safe for those with gout. You want to reduce the levels of uric acid in the blood, so eating foods that are low in purines will generally be safe foods like fruit. Cherries are anti-inflammatory and may even prevent gout attacks by lowering uric acid levels in the blood. Cherry juice that has little to no added sugar may also lower your risk of gout attacks. The wonderful deep color comes from the anthocyanins, which are full of powerful antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties which will do the body good. One study kept track of over 600 people who were suffering from gout. When they ate cherries over a period of two days, it lowered their risk of an attack by 35%. Number 3. Coffee Coffee lovers rejoice. Turns out that coffee is okay to drink if you have gout. A few different studies showed in both men and women that drinking at least one cup of coffee a day can significantly lower levels of uric acid in the blood and reduce the overall risk of gout. However, once you've had a few attacks of gout, coffee might not be as effective. Also keep in mind that drinking coffee may have an effect on other medical conditions, so make sure you speak to your doctor about the amount of coffee that's right for you. While we're on the topic of hot beverages, tea and green tea are also said to be safe for those with gout. Number 4. Milk Dairy products like milk and yogurt have been shown to help lower levels of uric acid in the blood. Some studies suggest that low-fat milk and other low-fat dairy products are your best bet as the proteins found in milk can also reduce uric acid levels. Frozen yogurt is also on the okay list. Yum! Number 5. Vegetables A good rule of thumb is that all vegetables are healthy anytime. You should be incorporating lots of veggies into your daily diet. After all, there's so many to choose from and there's so many different ways to prepare them. What's not to love? When it comes to gout, vegetables can give you the protein you may be missing since you should be limiting your intake of certain meats. Vegetables won't raise your levels of uric acid in the blood, which is your number one concern when you're looking to avoid painful flare-ups. All vegetables are safe, including those high in purine levels like asparagus and spinach, since they won't increase your risk of gout or gout attacks. Speaking of foods that are good for you, why don't you check out our video called 17 Superfoods You Should Make a Part of Your Daily Diet. Now, back to our list of foods that you can and cannot eat when suffering from gout. Number 6. Citrus you want to eat citrus fruits for their high concentration of vitamin C. Vitamin C can actually help lower uric acid levels in the blood and can prevent gout attacks from happening. Vitamin C helps the kidneys by removing the uric acid in the urine. There is sugar in citrus fruits, so you want to keep that in mind when eating any fruit. So opt for citrus like oranges, pineapple, grapefruit, and strawberries. Here are some foods you should be avoiding if you have gout. Number 1. Alcohol 
We hate to be the bearer of bad news, but beer and liquor have been known to bring on more attacks of gout and also increase the risk of developing gout in the first place. Beer has a high level of purine content which will up the level of uric acid in the blood, something you're trying to avoid, remember? Even non-alcoholic beer can raise these levels, so steer clear. You want to cut off booze completely when experiencing an attack, and in between, you want to avoid beer the most. If you're prone to gout attacks and getting gout, you should probably just avoid beer altogether. The good news is that wine doesn't seem to affect the onset of gout or increase the risk of a gout attack, but you should probably keep your consumption to a moderate level. Just be safe. Number 2. Soda Water is looking better and better, isn't it? Yep, soda's not your friend if you've been battling gout. It's high in sugar or high fructose corn syrup, which is not good for you at all and is found in most sodas. People who drink sugary drinks like soda and fruit juices are more likely to have gout. Number 3. Meat Don't worry, you don't have to become a vegetarian overnight. In fact, you don't have to be 100% plant-based at all. You can still have some meat. The ones you want to avoid are organ meats, like liver, tongue, and sweetbreads, which are really high in purines that can trigger a gout attack. You also want to limit your servings of beef, lamb, pork, and chicken. You can have those, but it should only be for a special occasion. White meats like chicken tend to be lower in purines than red meats, so stick to those whenever possible. Number 4. Seafood Again, you don't have to cut out all your favorite dishes. Some are really high in purines though, and you should keep away from fish like trout, salmon, and tuna. Some would argue that these types of fish are heart healthy, but to avoid a gout attack, you may want to keep those out of your diet. You should also limit your intake of lobster, oyster, shrimp, scallops, and mussels. Moderate portions of fish can be a part of a healthy gout diet. Other health changes you can make Diet isn't the only way to get rid of gout or prevent gout attacks from happening. Small changes in your lifestyle can help too. Here's a few things you can do to help lower your risk of gout or gout attacks. Maintain a healthy weight There are many reasons to maintain a healthy weight. But if you're overweight, making an effort to shed some pounds will help you avoid negative health complications like gout. Excess weight can cause the body to become insulin resistant, which can increase the risk of diabetes and other health-related issues. Losing weight can also lower levels of uric acid if you do struggle with gout. Regular exercise You knew this one was coming. Diet and exercise are the missing pieces to any healthy lifestyle. Regular exercise can help you lose weight in a healthy way and decrease the levels of uric acid in your system. A double win! Do you suffer from gout? Do you eat any of the foods on this list already? Let us know in the comment section below. We'd love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait! What kind of Bestie would we be if we didn't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video and enjoy.